2016, the George Kaiser Family Foundation was able to acquire Bob Dylan's archives. It turns out Dylan had been saving a trove of material over a period of about 60 years. The challenge with any archival collection is how to bring the materials to life. Our goal for the center was to trace this thread of creativity, and not just in music, but in visual arts, in his ironworks, in his filmmaking career, all of these aspects of Dylan's creative process. I think our approach to this project the entire time was that this was going to be a choir and it wasn't going to be a soloist. It was our job as sort of orchestra leaders to actually make it cohesive so that it all worked together, but we had many different creative talent that was actually contributing. Initially, we worked with the client team to understand all of the different partners that we would need, and very clearly it was evident that we would need a fabricator, not only just to sense check pricing, but also just to start working through a lot of the logistics. Creo, we had known about, and they just were lovely, and they were really able to articulate a lot of how they worked, and that was really evident to the client and to us that this was a partner that we could really communicate with well, that they would hold us to being responsible around the schedule and the budget, as well as they clearly have some great capabilities, not only in-house, but great partners, their ability to manage audiovisual content, as well as all the multimedia. When you walk inside, there's this extremely visceral multimedia experience where you hear Bob and learn about and hear his music and his work. In the center, we use these old 100-year-old columns and turn those into a definitive analysis of six songs. There is a very modern digital jukebox that was curated by Elvis Costello, and then there's the archive wall. The beauty of what Creo designed is that it's designed to change in perpetuity. They have designed it in such a way in detail that it actually can be sort of rotated and changed as they get new things that are added to the archive. At Creo, our experience is so deep, so broad, across so many different disciplines. We're able to pose questions early, foresee possibilities down the road, head them off before they become problems. That's what makes Creo a great collaborator. We hand off to them ideas, and they actually turn them into a reality. We could not have done this work without our partners, such as Creo, who really not only just actualized the vision that we brought to the table, but they added to it. It was in every construction element, in every choice of material. They're really thinking through the impact of the work. They were perfect partners for us because they weren't afraid to think big and they could hone in on every detail. And it was always with an eye on serving the visitor experience. And they did a beautiful job. Mm -hmm.